health news tonight, there's a lot of debate about wine and whether it's really good for you. But one thing's for sure, women and wine are becoming quite a pair. So what are the health benefits of opening up a bottle? And what about the harm in guzzling too much? Maybe C-15's Elizabeth Irwin explores both sides tonight. Cabernet, Pinot Grigio, Merlot, Pinot Noir. Ladies, no matter which you prefer, chances are high you've got a favorite wine. Uh, Cab. Depends if it's the summertime, I like Chardonnay. If it's the wintertime, I like Cab. Wine bars and lounges like the living room in Chandler are popping up all over the valley. Definitely, they're on almost every corner, it seems like. Judging by the standing room only here, the concept is working. And ladies, they're here for you. I want to say the majority of our clientele would be women. Um, and we did that on purpose, actually. Well, where the women go, the men follow. But the benefits behind your favorite red or white go beyond booming business. If people were to drink, I would say drink red wine. Registered dietitian and nutritionist Chrissy Barth knows her grapes. Red wine, I think, is better than white wine because you get the, um, the darker grapes that have that resveratrol in it. Health experts say red wine has antioxidants that may help increase levels of good cholesterol, protecting against artery damage, and potential Potentially helping with a variety of health problems. So red wine um, lowers our risk of heart attack, stroke, colon cancer, type 2 diabetes, dementia. But that doesn't mean you should down a bottle of Zinfandel with your dinner. The key is in moderation. Barth says women should have at most one glass a day. Men, two. But by glass, she means... A serving of wine is a five-ounce glass of wine. And for some women, that's easier said than done. It's not that you set out to, to, to be medicating yourself, but it's really easy also to go to cross that line. That's where you can get yourself into trouble, because you really can have too much of a good thing. Barth says too much wine can increase your risk of breast cancer. People that have had breast cancer or who have a history um, of breast cancer or who currently have breast cancer or who are at risk of breast cancer. And send everybody's triglycerides through the roof. They want to really back off on the amount of um, alcohol and red wine that they do drink. Bottom line, ladies, feel free to kick off your heels. Enjoy a glass of vino. Just share the bottle with some friends. Elizabeth Irwin, ABC 15 News. By the way, Barth says uh, white wine does have health benefits too, just not as many as red.